Hi there and welcome to the Dawn Show. Good morning, Dawn sends Lamenti here. So love is in the air. Valentine's Day is coming up and we're gonna give you some great ideas to help make your Valentine's Day a whole lot more special. You're gonna look good with this one. My first guest is gonna help us add more sparkle to the special day, Nate Barsky from Barsky Diamonds in the house. And this is actually a family business for you. So this goes back how many generations? It goes, it goes back five generations, uh, 117 years. I'm the fifth. And then uh, my kids are going to be the six when they come in. Oh, that's wonderful. So, yeah, it's a lot of fun. So you, you kind of know your career path. Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> it, it follows you. It's, it's addictive once you get into it. It's fun helping people get engaged and deal with love and stuff like that. Yeah, right. so the, the Barsky family has been in, uh, involved. Well, the experts in, on love. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Well, let's get started. I mean, I love some of these beautiful sparklers that you have here. Yeah, I think the biggest thing for Valentine's Day would be like the heart. And this is a puffed heart, and it's the largest one I carry. Um, typically, I think the better, the bigger, the better. That's right. Size does matter. Size does matter. Diamonds uh, and the puffer heart. And so they're all pave set, and you have about five and a half carats here of colorless, flawless diamonds. Um, and I carry them in all different qualities for all different price ranges, too. I brought some of the bigger stuff today. Um, so that, and then we've also been doing the pink diamonds for the holidays too. Which are gorgeous. Oh God, they're beautiful. And so these, like when you compare, uh, I'm just gonna hold it up so we can get a shot. When you compare like a pink diamond to, let's say even a pink sapphire or some of these other pink stones. Well, the, it's the rarest, the diamond, when it's pink. And it also has the highest reflective index, so it's gonna sparkle 10 times more than a sapphire would. So a pink diamond is is even more rare than a blue or white. Oh, definitely, it's the rarest. Red's the rarest color. Okay. But pink's right there. Wow, and then, then you gorgeous. can go into the yellow diamonds too. I know we have people in the studio like taking photos, saying mm -hmm. you know, sending to their husband. They can come down and help them out. So let's show you this one. So this That's is my a, favorite color. This is your favorite. That's the Why? yellow. Why? I just it looks like sunshine. It's just really pretty, especially the contrast with the white diamonds. Sunshine. Man, it does. <laughs> it does. Look at it. If you look real into it, it's, you know, it's That's a, gorgeous. It's a beautiful, beautiful color. So, you know, part of what you said with the Barsky family is, mm -hmm. and you grew up with this, yes. so you know, you know things since you're a little kid, but uh, yeah. what do you tell people about diamonds? Because a lot of people say, well, there are a lot of deals out there, well, there's, and they get ripped off. Yeah, diamonds, it's not like stereo equipment. You can't just buy it off specs and stuff like that. It's, a, it's an object of beauty, and it could look beautiful on paper because most diamonds are certified, but what they look like in person is a, another animal. Um, so I always say when you're buying a diamond or any piece of jewelry, you need to see it and feel it and really check it out. So um, it's not something, it's the one thing you would say, don't just buy it online. Oh no, definitely not. Definitely not. Because you can have diamonds that have internal graining, they can be foggy, but their color and clarity can be great. But there can be other um, characteristics that can make the stone not be as brilliant or beautiful. What's something that your, let's say your grandfather's watching right now, right. so that Grandfather Barsky always taught you? Wear a tie. <laughs> uh oh, you failed yeah, on that I know, one. I failed. <laughs> <laughs> no, he always taught me never judge a book by a car uh, uh, by its cover. Uh, treat everybody with uh, if they want to spend ten dollars up to a hundred thousand dollars, you treat everybody the same. Um, and quality is our main thing. You know, that's really what's at. So when you look at all the different grading, if somebody's looking for something and they can't afford to buy the perfect. Stone. What do they want to look for then? I, I like my diamonds to be eye clean. Uh, What's no, that mean? no carbon spots, no salt and pepper, you know, visible to the naked eye in the diamond. Um, I also like it to, you know, uh, color doesn't bother me as much as long as you're in the upper end of it, you know, K or better. Um, like here, this is a white stone, and that's an H color right there. So okay. it's a beautiful color. Color starts D E F, which is colorless, okay. and then G H I J, which is near colorless. So I suggest that kind of color range, H I, um, but G I A certified. That's the best certificate you can get for a diamond. Okay. And typically, when it's a G I A certified diamond, it is what it is. So this is H, so mm -hmm. it's down yeah, there a it's little down bit, there a little but bit. it's stunning. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, especially when you compare it next to a stone that is sort of yellow. Okay. And you can see how white it is. The contrast of it. So that's amazing that you can, so you can say to somebody, if they say, this is my price range. Yes. You can, I can still steer, find something gorgeous. Oh, definitely. Especially in our store, we're wholesale, so. And what about the bracelets, the tennis bracelets? Now I brought a, a large one so you could see it. This one here, I think okay, is 19 carats. 19 carats. 19 carats. Wow. Um, the, the diamonds are VS quality, HI color, they're beautiful. 
That is gorgeous. Yeah, that that's is stunning. A, a very nice Valentine's present. That would this would be if my husband Larry's watching. This would be, <laughs> this would be great. Yeah, I think you, you could definitely <laughs> use that. I'd wear it. It's beautiful. <laughs> So with these, is there something that, that is a no-no for a girlfriend or, you know what I mean? Is there, are there no-nos in there? Do no, you have some I, rules? No, I don't have any rules. Okay. I think everything goes with jewelry. <laughs> you can't go wrong. And what about with the puffer hearts? Mm -hmm. In other words, you have all different sizes. All different sizes from like this is the size of a, a silver dollar down to a uh, nickel. You know? Wow. And I, when they're smaller, they're really cute because it, it gives a real tight sparkle with all the different diamonds. And you know what, um, and we want to put up actually, uh, we have a full screen where people can get all your information, just so you know, it's Barsky Diamonds. It's right there on Sansom Street, 724 Sansom, Philadelphia, and there's your phone number. And also people can look you up on the web, BarskyDiamonds.com. You yes. know I want to ask you about though, because mm -hmm. uh, my stepdaughter Station, her husband Justin, just had a baby, baby hey, Emmeline, first very grandchild. Nice. Very nice. And so my husband wanted to get her something. Okay. So for that, you know, father to a daughter, especially first baby, do you have recommendations for gifts like those? Well, you have to be careful because babies eat stuff. <laughs> you know, no, this so is for mommy. Oh, mommy for did all mommy. the work. Mommy, there you go. This okay. Is for mommy. Yeah, I always say either um, the birthstone, but I like a diamond pendant or diamond earrings. Okay. Because the earrings, you always wear them every day. You can't go wrong, and, the, and babies, they won't grab them. Nice. That's my suggestion. And do you have special charms, like for charm bracelets? Uh, you like can do like that. your nose? You could do definitely. a puffer heart on a charm. Exactly. Too. I made that for my wife. I gave her a nice heavy uh, link with a, with a puff tart on it. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty. It's a, it adds a little sparkle to it. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, your wife's lucky. She yeah. married into a good family with uh, the yeah, diamonds, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. That's and she a, got me. <laughs> and she got you, yeah. <laughs> even though you don't have the tie. That's right. <laughs> Nate Barsky, Barsky Diamonds, thank you so much. Thank a you. little Valentine's advice. And the biggest advice, of course, is don't is, forget. Yes, get something. Get something. Get something. <laughs> thank you, Nate. You're welcome. Thank you. And we're going to be right back with some good wine ideas and Valentine's Day ideas coming right up here on The Dawn Show.